Okay, y'all, so I have a very exciting word to bring forth to you all today. Um, this is a dream, a prophetic dream um, word. I haven't did a prophetic dream uh, regarding marriage um, and deliverance together. So this is a word of marriage and deliverance, the title of this word. And this is an announcement. This is a... a um, I don't want to say urgent, but it is urgent. You know, God didn't tell me urgent, but it's giving urgency vibes in this dream. Amen. And so God don't have to tell me when it's obvious. Amen. So I don't want it to be, um, I don't want you to be anxious, but I want you to be prepared and I want you to be aware of the times that we in for many of you. Amen. Um, before I give it a, a title, this is what I'm going to say, um, because there's a lot of people, I'm not going to say a lot of people, but, um, the normal way of doing things, right? So we know that dealing with God and in Christ, there's a certain lifestyle that, that, um, we ought to have, amen. Um, for God is holy, therefore we should be holy. Um, I'm not going to really get in too deep with that, but you know, the normal or the average or the norm lifestyle that should be kept right. But how many of you know that we serve a gracious God? Amen. How do you, how many of you know that our thoughts is not God's thoughts? Our ways is not God's ways. Amen. So what I want to rejoice in, and I want you guys to get happy about for the group of you, um, this is not just for this specific group, but for the group of you, you're going to, you're going to, you're going to, be more excited about what I'm about to get ready to say on this part that you know um, um, you know you know God is a merciful um, gracious um, forgiving God and it's not just about that it's about God's ways and his thoughts is not our ways and thoughts so how the world or um, the the um, the normal things are done god is not always moving like that amen so for 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 some of for some of you um uh well this one i'm gonna say really quick i'm sorry so some people they're you know when they're giving these words they're like you know boasting in doing everything right or you know abstaining from certain things or like really following the rules right you know, um, I don't want to make it seem like that's a bad thing or it's that serious because we know that we're not perfect and we know that we're not condemned in Christ. Um, but, you know, some some people, and including myself, uh, during, um, including myself, like, you know, um, uh, I've preached on that before. But again, God's thoughts, his ways are not ours. So for that even if you feel, you know, um, or you know that you're not exactly meeting a certain standard that you also desire and you also feel, um, um, you feel accountable to do. Amen. But again, our fathers, his thoughts and ways are not our ways. So he's saying, I get the normal way and I get what you ought to do amen but that doesn't exclude you amen it works for your good amen and not giving an excuse to a certain way of doing things or a lifestyle I'm not saying none of that I'm saying it is still possible and if you run by this message and you fit this, your, the shoe fit of what I'm saying, this word is for you. That's what I'm saying. Amen. So, um, um, God is good. God is good. You're right where you need to be. Amen. Um, and even when we feel it some type of way, God will still work it out for your good. Because we, that's what type of God we serve. We serve a gracious God. And he's not just a God. He's our father. So is that part. 
that part. He's our father. Amen. So let me give y'all the title. It is wonderful, um, exciting announcement given by <laughs> word. Amen. Prophetic word. It's called arranged marriages and deliverance. Arrange marriages and deliverance word. Amen. I'ma start. I'ma I'ma start like not putting the title in the description so that it can be a grand thing when I just say it verbally because it's like it's not giving grand vibes if I'm already putting it in the description. And you're like, okay, I already know the title. So it's like, wow, we wasting too much time on giving the title. But it's exciting. Like, it's exciting. It's exciting. You know, it's it's better to say it than to put it in the description unless you, like, mess up on the title or something like that. Like, you know. Um, but, uh, yeah. All right. So, um, y'all bear with me. Holy Ghost, come through because... Um, I just had this dream before I woke up and I don't want to miss anything. And I prayed already. Let me pray again. Um, Father God, we thank you for this glorious day. We thank you for this glorious time. We thank you that you have raised us up and we are, um, prepared and we are, um, doing life as such a time as this, Father God. Um, there's no greater time than the time of the now, um, when you are speaking and when you are moving. So Father God, we just thank you so much for just being a good, 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 gracious, um, almighty, all knowing, a purposeful, intentional God. We thank you that everything was a part of the plan, Father God. And if there was something that wasn't a part of the plan, Father God, you know how to get the glory out of it and make it work for us to where it became a part of the plan. Um, so, Father God, we just thank you so much, Father. I just pray that we just continue to be on board with you, Father God, no matter what we go through, no matter how we feel, Father God, that we continue to give our hearts to you. We continue to give our secrets to you. We continue to give our mind to you. Our like We continue to give ourselves to you, Father God, because you are our husband first. You, you care for us, Father God. We are we belong to you, Father God, and we should be connected to you, God, as we exist in this earth, Father God, for you created us at such a time as this, God, and we must be connected to you. We must be connected to our source, Father God, to get this thing, God, to understand this thing, to be effective, God, to be in right standings with you, Father God, to just fulfill our purpose in this earth. So, God, I just pray that you bless uh, the pe your people. Bless your people, Father God. Bless your holy name, Father God. Bless these unions, Father God. Bless these families, God. And Lord, I, I don't have to, we don't have to ask you, God, because that's the whole word, Father God, because you have blessed the unions, God. You have blessed the families, God. And so we thank you so much for providing us this word, Father God, of clarity, of insight of what you're doing. And God, we give you all the honor and the glory, Father God, because we know that we know uh, what really goes on, Father God. But again, your thoughts and your ways is not our thoughts and our ways. So therefore, Father God, everything was a part of the plan. And we just thank you because you, you, your plans are mas masterpieces, God. You, you are the master at planning, Father God. You is perfect. Your will is perfect. You're perfect in all your ways. You make no mistake or error. So we just thank you for that, Father. We thank you, God. Um, position us to receive, Father God, what you have for us. God, we thank you that nothing can be altered of what you're doing in our lives, Father God, that our lives, God, and your plans for us, God, is protected. We're protected. We're covered, Father. We're covered, God. And 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 we thank you um, that you will continue to get the glory out of our life, God. When you get the glory, it's working for us. The word, your word says, Father God, that all things work together for those that love the Lord and are called to his purpose. So, Father God, we thank you that 
as you get the glory, Father, things work for us. When things work for us, you get the glory. You get pleasure in things working for us, for, for we being taken care of and things working out in your favor as a parent, as the best parent, as the great, gracious parent that you are. So we just thank you so much, Lord. We honor you. In your son's name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Thank you, Lord. Amen. All right. So um, let's see. This dream. So this is my first time actually um, saying it. Um, other than it being in my mind. Um, and I wanted to record it um, for when God do have me to release it. So um, let's see. I'm trying to remember the beginning of the word. All right. So all I know is it's going to be bits and pieces. It's not going to be. I don't remember it. Um, I read denounce that. I'm going to just say it from how I remember. And I don't know what order... I, you know, again, I would denounce that. Your words are powerful. So I'm just going to say it. Amen. Um, all right. Um, so this dream was a family setting, right? And um, my future husband was there. Family were, were there. And it was people really operating in their gifts, their spiritual gifts, like discernment. Um, uh, I remember it was another family member that was around me to provide me the insight every now and then of what was going on. So it was like, it was a family setting. It was like a dating setting and it was a celebration, right? And um, it was my family and it was like other people. It was like my family, right? Um, it was some of my family and um, it was like other people that I didn't know, but they were, things were being arranged for them as well. Like it was like it, it, how I, it was like, you know, how you have a, um, a arranged date, like, you know, those shows where, you know, they sitting at the table and, you know, but it, except we. I don't want to say where we're living, but it was like a scene where it was a group of people apart from my family, right? It was a group of people that were, it was like things were being arranged for us as far as marriage, but that wasn't being said. It was just more of acting out, right? And I had, um, um, it was um, basically my daughter was there and she was telling me like what she saw, like, you know, but in the dream, she wasn't like my daughter. I didn't, it wasn't like, it was acknowledged that she was my daughter. It was just her operating in the gifts, letting us know bits and pieces at certain time of what was going on from what we couldn't see. And me and the arranged group, we were just acting out, right? Um, not acting out in a crazy sense. I mean, just like um, we we're just doing, if that makes sense. Like we were just, it was just going, we we're going forth in the scene, right? And so... Um, let me turn this off. And, um, so, um, what else? Um, so in this dream, it was, we didn't know, like, okay, I knew who I was fixed on, right? And I knew who I liked, but I don't think, I think, Okay, the other person that I liked and I was fixed on, right? I wouldn't say necessarily fixed. It's just I know that he's my husband, right? I already been dreaming about him, but um, he liked me too. But it was like we had to play out what was arranged. So we didn't get caught up on, on anybody until we knew. Like it was like being arranged spiritually, but we, it's like somehow we knew, but it's not like, we got orders or some, we were told, you know what I mean? It wasn't like that. It was just like life, you know, but it was like, it was, it was, it, it, it was beautiful. Um, and it's making me excited because I know exactly what God is doing. And so, um, 
So again, my daughter in this dream, she was acting, um, her, she was operating her spiritual gift of discerning, discern, discernment. And she was like, again, she was telling us certain things. And it was me, my future husband. But again, it wasn't revealed that he was my husband. I was just drawn to him and only him. See, he had options, right? In the dream, I remember it was this other girl, right? And I don't remember feeling like, you know, she was a threat. I just was hoping that he knew or not knew, but because it wasn't like that serious in the dream where it was like, I hope you know who I am and I know exactly who I am. It was just like I was drawn to this person and I was fixed on him. I only had eyes for him. Him, on the other hand, he was just like chilled. I feel like he were more drawn to me, but then he had options, right? It was given those vibes because there was another female there and it was like other guys and stuff. It was like a, a small arranged group, right? I catch that in the spirit. So this word is most likely for um, a, a small um, percentage or a group of us because there are already people that God has um, blessed in marriage and there's um, people that... Um, you know, just barely probably getting delivered. So, you know, they're not ready for marriage. But in some cases, you have people that get delivered and get married at the same time. Whatever God's plan is for you, you know, God's thoughts and ways is not our ways. But those are some of the ways, so some examples. But for this word, just for me saying that, so it's only a small group of us. And when we say small percentage and small group, you got to understand the whole world. So it's not like only five of us or even 5,000. It's, you know, it's, excuse me, we don't know the number, but it's, you know, from the broad perspective, like say if the world was, I don't know, I, um, say it was uh, the, everybody in the world is, is 100%, right? So maybe a third out of the 100% or if the, you, you get what I'm saying, is this word is pertaining to um so um yeah all right so um we i remember we were like on the couch we were it was like a home in the center vibe like it was kind of weird um we were it was the small group of us and um, my daughter, she was operating in discernment and she was telling us um, she seen certain things on our face that, um, what would she say? I forgot what she, what she seen exactly. Um, oh, I think it was the part of it being arranged, like who we belong to type of thing or something like that. Um, and... Um, I don't rem really, I'm not remembering more, it's m much more, but I'm going to go ahead and jump to um, the family part. All right. So it was, this is the last part. Um, it was um, a celebration. It was like, I think it was my other daughter birthday party, right? But the who party it was it wasn't really highlighted right but it was a it was a it was a gathering it was a celebration like a birthday party right and in this birthday party i remember um i'm not gonna say who 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 they are but um i remember walking over to a table like you know and it was two important people to me in my life right um one that um, that, um, I really pray for a lot, you know, a family member, right. That, um, that, you know, that needed deliverance, right. Like, like need, you know, um, deliverance and another person who is dear to me, but I'm not really close with. So I pray for this person, but not as much as I should have. Um, um, and I don't know what they represent, um, all I know is that according, I, I'm going to just say it and then, 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 um, yeah, let me just say it. So according to the arrangement, 
that God have for us, for those of you that God is arranging your marriages and you have been, you have um, made yourself available, not perfect, not being per perfect in the process, right? But you made yourself available, meaning you didn't give yourself to another. You didn't um, like, you know, you didn't um, marry somebody else. Like you didn't, you know, you, you, you kind of, you not you didn't kind of, but you stuck with God in the process, even though you wasn't perfect, amen. Or you may have did everything that you're supposed to do, but for me, I didn't do everything that I was supposed to do. But I've I've stuck with God in the process, amen. I, I was not perfect, and you know I had perfect moments, um, according to me, right? But God's ways. And plans are not ours. So what is defined perfect? Amen. What is the right way? The right way is the way that it worked out. You know, um, I believe so long as we stay connected to God, you get him saying, God call, count that as perfect. God count that as righteous. Amen. God count that. He still, you know, he, you know, so according to our arranged marriages, right? comes alignment to where things that we've been waiting on and things that um we've been believing God to do is going to hit like it's like it's like this arrangedness arrange everything in your life and everything that you love amen amen y'all it, it arrange everything that you love so again it was a table of two people, right? One that I've been praying for and the other person that I prayed for and might have need the prayer more than the other one. It's just the other one is more closer to me. Um, you know what I mean? So, yeah, but they were delivered in my dream. They were delivered. And I remember walking over to them and I was telling them, I was like, I was kissing them and I was like, I'm so glad. I'm like, I'm so proud of y'all. And I'm like, um, I love y'all so much. And I'm so happy for you guys. They were delivered. So they were in their prime. They were living their best life. They were um, delivered and free. They were set free. They were just enjoying their company and enjoying the celebration. And I remember coming over, greeting them and telling them how much I'm, you know, glad, you know, and proud of them, you know, and just happy, you know. So, again, the deliverance came with the alignment. I mean, I mean not the alignment. Yeah, the alignment, um, the arranged marriages that God ordained in our lives. So it was like we were... um it was like a group was called together, right? And it was like, as we were um, um, moving forward, you know, just doing whatever we were doing, things were being revealed to us. Um, we, like, it was like, it was like, it, okay, things were being revealed to us. And then it was revealed to us who was um, destined to, um, to be together so the the arrangement was re revealed then it was a celebration and in the celebration it was um it was um how would you say it was um you know people that were connected to us and i i didn't see other people it was just it was my life so i just seen my life right um in this part with the celebration and stuff and it were people that you know, we've been praying for and that needed to be delivered in our family, they were delivered. So, mm, my God, y'all better catch this. Who God is good, y'all. God is so good. Man, he is so good. So, again, the title of this word is Arranged, Arranged, E-D, with the E-D, Marriages and Deliverance Word. So, God have confirmed his arrangement or God arranged um, a group, right? He, he arranged your marriage um, and the person that God has for you, you will marry them. And in God's um, arrangedness and through your arranged marriage, 
once um you know what i mean and it's and another thing to highlight that just came to my mind is that the other person is fully on board you know that and that's that's something um uh new you know to where the person were in position for the arrangement amen and we were just waiting on it to be revealed like it was like the final confirmation right again because we were already attracted attracted and you know drawn to certain people although mine was single and his it was like it it wasn't as single and he had options so he was like kind of it kind of seemed like he was reserved and kind of waiting on god but he were more drawn to me amen because <laughs> um i was i'm the chosen person for this person so um with god's arrangement um arrangement of our marriages comes deliverance for our family so it's a full package so so that's the word of god that you know he are it's time y'all it's time and just know with these arranged marriages and as you guys walk into matrimony and to um, full, like you guys come one unto God, right? You know, the marriage, the ceremony happens that, 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 that everything else that needs to happen in your family and that God plan your, you know, your other, you know, like it's that those things are happening as well deliverance in your family breakthroughs like it's 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 going to be a mass just blessed time for you and your your family through this arrangedness and alignment it's like now god can bless you Ooh, now god can bless you how he wants to because now everything is is in position for that blessing it can't hold. It's not meant now. But when God, when those marriages go forth, and it's and it's it's as it happened, boom! Now it's now you're completely in 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 position for the fullness of God. You know what I mean? For God to bless you how He really want to bless you. Congratulations. Congratulations. That is my time. You all be blessed. And I want to hear the testimonies. And I cannot wait to share my testimony with you all. God bless you guys. Be blessed and be encouraged. Amen.